Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Hyperlay where we get the most up to date Star Citizen news as they drop. All right, just a few hours ago, uh, CIG just released uh, Star Citizen Alpha 3.17.2A. Uh, they just went live and um, just to uh, give you guys a quick update on exactly what dropped with it. So in regards to gameplay, the combat assistance service beacons, uh, they lower the frequency of the uh, low threat missions, increase the frequency of the moderate, high and critical threat missions, fixed an issue that was causing the combat service beacons to pay much more than intended, additional balance pass uh, to the combat assistance payment and adjusting the probability of mission difficulty spawn frequency. Uh, change the max uh, button on the ship kiosk to uh, plus 10. Uh, friends list is now sorted alphabetically. Okay, and then ships and vehicles, uh, they reduce the HP of multiple parts of this area later. All right, so uh, just a few major uh, bug fixes. They fix an issue causing multiple elevators to break and not function. This is huge. A lot of people, man, I've been, I've been seeing this you know, all throughout this patch. Um, partly, um, party launch should not work uh, more consistently. Fix an issue causing the UGF mission AI to go missing and block missions from completing. Fix a bug where the search and destroy mission where probes destroyed counter report wrong if you destroy the probes before the mission says you located them. All right, so this is just a few um, of the major bug fixes. I'm gonna put the link to the patch notes uh, in the description. All right, I will see you on the next one.